The clock some people living in Rock Hill may not know about a sweet full circle moment that happened over at Sunset Park Center of Accelerated Studies. Yeah, the school is set to move into a new building within the next few years, but a part of its legacy is going with it. WBTV's Erica Lunsford has a story from Rock Hill. Hey guys. How are you? The halls of Sunset Park Center of Accelerated Studies may seem a little bit smaller for its principal, Nakia Barnes. I don't think I ever told you all this, but I was a third grade teacher in the same classroom. You were? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Not only did she teach here. This is the community that I grew up in. So right down the street, um, that's where I live. My parents still live there and I came to school here. And so I'm, I'm just invested in the community. That's right. She walked these halls as a fourth grader. Although Barnes ventured away from Sunset Park to go to college and teach at other schools, all routes led her back to the school, leading children of her former students. One, he's in 4K now. So it's just amazing for him to say, my mommy said you were her teacher. <laughs> and so I'm like, yeah. The school was built in the 1950s. Over the summer, the district announced the school will be getting a new place to call home on school property. Serving as a Title I school, Barnes is grateful students will be able to have a new place to learn and explore their gifts and talents. It, it will be bittersweet, but it also be, will be a great moment to see our kids go into a new building um, with new up-to-date technologies. When we go over to the new building, the first thing we're going to make sure we remember is to cherish what we already have. See you later. See you later. Serving as the principal for five years, she might be helping to educate the school's next teacher or principal. And that's why I'm here. I, I, we love our kids, um, not only for the academic standpoint, but for the social, emotional, the physical, the whole child. Barnes says the new Sunset Park School is set to be completed in 2026, right before that school year. In terms of the original building, she says part of it will be demolished, but the other part will still be used here in Rock Hill as a community center. Reporting in Rock Hill, Erica Lunsford, WBTV, on your side. It's great to meet people inside the schools better like that, Erica. Thank you. Jay